The Shanghai International Port Company won the bid in late March to operate a new port in Haifa for 25 years, starting from 2021. The new port, whose construction is underway, is expected to be completed by 2020 and will be able to handle 1.86 million standard containers, making it the largest harbor in Israel by then. The Shanghai company says it will employ its experience and technologies, as well as its long-term relations with shipping lines, to develop Haifa's new port into a regional transport hub. Investing in Haifa's new port will help strengthen business relations between the Shanghai port and other ports along the maritime Silk Road. Investing in Haifa's new port will help from close-knit logistics network between the Shanghai port and ports in Europe. Chen said that under the agreement, the company will invest around two billion dollars for building facilities at the harbor and purchasing equipment for the harbor. Calling himself a pioneer in strengthening Israel-China relations, Israeli Transport Minister Israel Katz says the multi-billion U.S. dollar investment plan is an expression of confidence in Israel on the part of a superpower. <laughs> The Chinese firm is bringing its capabilities to the port's development, and it will, of course, strengthen the relations between China and Israel. And I'm happy for that. Katz said Israel is now investing four billion to five billion dollars each year to upgrade its transport infrastructure and is building airports, seaports, railroad tracks, roads, and tunnels. He believed there is a high potential for closer Israel-China cooperation in the area of infrastructure. According to official estimates, the new port in Haifa is expected to offer hundreds of jobs directly and generate thousands more jobs indirectly in the country after it becomes operational by 2021.